Welcome back to our casual playthrough of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. This is Jekarasa with Mini Gamers, and we are trying to figure out how to get underneath here, because um, I'm pretty sure down there is where we'll find both the uh, shrine and the bubble frog. Um, I'm thinking, though, I'm going to have to go over here. So we have some ball fruits. I'm not going to bother with them. I'm pretty sure it was... There was a cave over here when we checked the, uh, what's it we call it? The tree, the uh, Satori. Yeah, there was a mole right there. You guys can't see anything. sorts of stuff here, but oh. that's where we were. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. Oh, there's something here too. Let's see. I'm get the other dude, but this works. Interesting. Oh, it's just a way to get to the top of all that is. <laughs> Interesting, okay. Anything else around here? Things going out to another cave entrance thing. Yeah. Hmm. Well, wasn't the the uh, thing I was expecting? The what you call it? The shrine. Yeah, I should probably get rid of it now. Metal stuff. This. Um. Yeah, that's the only one I got. So. <laughs> okay. And that kind of sucks. I'll just get this one. Okay. 
Well, uh, let's go ahead and get rid of this. Okay, but it's somewhere up there. I've already gone through all these. Just need. I just need to wait here for a minute. Honestly. Okay, there's no wood. Wait till morning. We'll see if that brightens things up a bit. There we go. Okay. Brightened it up and made it so I could actually use my stuff that I want to use. Okay. Now. Sound is. <laughs> oh wait. I don't know why that works, but it works. Oh wait, is it a one, two, three, four thing? I bet that's it. One, two, three, yeah, and then four over here. Okay. Okay, I get it now. Huh. 
that it? Up here first. Thinking that might be the way in, but not seeing anything there. Huh. Why the heck is this? This is where I was. So it was here all this time, just multiple entrances. Dude. Come on. There. So basically, if I'd taken the, uh, the little place that they gave me when I did the uh, bomb thing under the frog. Um, if I had descended from there, then I would have come up right there. I would have seen this. There wasn't just a way to get up to where the enemies were and where I could rescue the dude. Interesting. Okay, well, I'm glad there's a different way to get there because I would have been lost for a long time without it. Jewels or weapons? Yeah. Oh, a blessing shrine. I mean, I guess it was hard enough to find. Seems kind of weird though, because you wouldn't think it would be that hard to find, but I guess it was. Ooh, a diamond mace. How many of those do I have? Five. I don't have any near enough. Oops. There. Alright, is that eight? I think that's eight. Is it eight? Yes, it is. So I could totally go get another two hearts. But I also want to check and see how I'm doing on um, on my what you call it on my uh, my armor stuff. Let's just get out of here. Okay. Um, let's take a look here first. My original plan was to basically take that one and then go down here and here. I can get there easy enough from some more of this. Um, there's a bunch of caves here I can explore too, so I could just come back here and explore these caves on the way. But I do think I'm going to go ahead and uh, run over to Outlook, Great Lookout Landing. Let's grab a couple more hearts. I don't have enough for any battery, do I? I don't think I do. I haven't been underneath uh, in the depths enough, I don't think. Unless, of course, I use a forge and make more. I do have quite a bit of zonite. Alright, let's at least get this, these two hearts first. Heart container. Yeah. I can definitely use more of these. 
I was thinking that I was doing really, really well, having lots of heart containers. Honestly, I if I don't get better armor, then I always have issues with some of the bigger, uh, bigger enemies like Lionels and others. So, this. All right. Um. Okay, let's go over here. Is there any new stuff over here? No. Don't be sick. Don't be worried sick. Come on. Yeah, you're you're talking about Lurlin as if it's still got problems, but I yeah, fire's already gone. <laughs> and Rosella and everyone from the village are okay too. Thank goodness, I'm so glad they're all safe. I was beside myself. Top it off, the ruined buildings have all been restored. Thank you for bringing us the best possible news. Please have this as a sign of our gratitude. Mighty salt guilt grill crab. Okay. That's cool. Find us a cooking. It's a dish that really brings out the warrior in you. Please enjoy. Mm. If I'd gone to the village back normal, I have to wonder how our little shop back home is looking. Even if I have to go on my own, maybe I should return to Laurel uh. Village. If you'd be lonely without me, then I can stay here, Mom. Huh? That'd be ridiculous. If Laurel were restored, we villagers need to come together and bring life back to our once bustling little village. Uh. I can take care of the shop here, no problem. You should get the village shop open too, pronto, and start saving money too. Uh, Good call, yeah. So I'd have to to stay with you a while longer. Uh, <laughs> okay, I'll make my way to learn the village, leave the village shop to me. Okay, cool. Glad they're keeping this one open at least. Let's just grab a few things here. Got them all. How much of this do I have? One five. Let's go ahead and grab him. About no six as well. And then I always need more fish. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see. And where oh, the lines right there? Sixty-eight. Okay. I do have 18 of these. That's another thing I want to do. Um, let's see. You know what? If I go, what is it? Right here. Here, during the night, he will be there. He always is. Let's do it. I'm going to have to switch over some old clothes. And then we'll go to the ferry and see what we got as far as other stuff goes with our armor. But I think I should have enough to finish this out because I'm pretty sure the next one is uh, is the one I need. The last of the armor sets. Okay, wait. Where is he? You know what? I can't remember where exactly she is. I think it's beyond the, beyond the stable, but I can actually um, just grab some wood, sleep till night. And then we'll be good. There he is, yep. It was that way. Okay. Look at that Korok, but I I really dislike Koroks. <laughs>
Hey, horse. Run away. All right, here we go. Just about there. Couple gems. Yeah. Good evening, traveler. How weather can't felt my mood when I'm on my way to Prince of Tori. See, that's the thing I'm thinking is next up there. The headpiece for this thing. Of course, it's Lionel one first, but, you know. Gobs of bubble gems? Let's trade. Four. I'll give you the Lionel mask. So let's do it. Let's do it. I need more bubble gems. Yeah, yeah, okay. There we go. Lionel mask. Good to see the real Lionel. Oh, it's not. The, okay, that's just a symbol of what he wants next. Never mind. Okay, well, let's go ahead and keep trading. Three thunder glyph horns. Four bubble gems, sure. I wonder how many more of these. I need to do this third that he runs out of stuff to give you before you run out of bubble gems. You can keep getting bubble gems. There it is, there it is. Okay. Wow, what do I need to eat all the bubble gems? Traveler, I promise this is the last thing I'll ask of you. Would you, prettiest, please, collect all of the remaining bubble gems? Ah. No, it's not right. I don't have a single treasure left to trade. I couldn't. I shouldn't ask this your favorite review. Okay, so that's the thing. There's no more treasure. But he still wants bubble gems. Okay. Um go ahead and head over to this easily accessible great fairy because I'm a travel medallion. That is probably my, my most useful travel medallion I have since I only have one other one that I have pretty much never go to. Um, I mean, one other one that I've posted, replaced. The other one I have, I don't, I haven't put it anywhere. So yeah, it's probably put it somewhere. Military tree. Okay, let's see if I do have any. Um, Be sure I do, right? Okay. Let's do it by set. Um, what do I need for the. Oh, fire breath and sulfos, too. Okay, smothering butterflies. Hmm. Stealth and trout. Sticky frogs. Sticky, I need way more sticky frogs. Where do I find sticky frogs? Lionel silver horns? Dude, I've got like the silver ones. Why do I need regular ones? Yep. Yeah. Gift ones. Sticky frogs there too. Uh, those don't really matter. Oh, here we go. Paracuda. Oh. <laughs> Interesting. Gliacum. Does that mean any type of gliacum? I wonder. Okay. So, Paracuda. Deep Fire mm. Frost is first. Huh? I don't think it uses anything that's the same as anything else. These are kind of unique. Do you want to get this to two, though? Dude, fox rings? Really? Well. Oh. 
Might as well mm -hmm. enough for one of them. But mm -hmm. so I need to face more regular foxes, more obsidian foxes. There we go. That's better. Twelve. Huh? Mm -hmm. um, these aren't enhanceable. These I can do diamonds with. I'm not gonna do that. I don't. I don't use them enough to make them worthwhile. Okay, so I can do one of these. Um, probably this one, I guess. Mm. It doesn't really matter. Huh? Honestly, I think most of my money goes towards this stuff. Oh. I mean, I do mm. buy a lot of other stuff, so maybe it goes to buy huh? materials. Um, yeah. What do I need for this, by the way? Dinner all scale. I might as well do that. I mean, this is actually a really good thing. It gets my attack up. So I need a dinner all scale. Um, are there other ones? Or this? Captain Construct one horn. <laughs> Not that again. There's been a Blood Moon since then, though, so I can go back and get those two. I just don't know where any others are. Two that are in the cold area up the top. The sky, Great Sky Island. Nice breath, electric. That flame horn. Okay, well, need more sticky frogs and stuff, too. What do I need here? You know what? No, I'm not gonna, gonna waste it. I, I, I never use that armor. So, forget it. Let's, <laughs> let's not do it just for the sake of doing it, not this early in the game. I mean, it's not early in the game, but compared to where it, I mean, it could be, this is pretty early. Ah, oh, dude, you already used up your, your heart on your hand. Come on. Okay. Um. Let's see. I got a few options now. Um, I could go back and explore these caves over here, like I was thinking of doing. Um, I could go try and find some sticky frogs, which I have no idea where the where a large amount of those are. So I don't know if that would work real well. Um, I could go try to do the Zolfo stuff since I need a lot of those. Um, I need more Aracuda stuff. I need a lot of everything, basically. Um, you know, Froxes, Obsidian Froxes. I could go to this Great Sky Islands. Um, and I could go over here. Where go over here. I could go here and take on these people over here. Um, I could go randomly find stuff in the sky. Huh. This over here. Okay. You know what? Let's let's go ahead and. Find some caves. Oh, I don't need this armor anymore. <laughs> it's not cold. I'm at 108 shrines. I believe... There are 160 shrines total in this game. I've heard that it's split. Um, I heard that it's split like 120 on the surface and 40 in the sky. Um, I'm not 100% sure if that's accurate. That's what I've heard. Okay, just like, where are we going? 
Okay, so we don't have to go across there. We just have to do this one. Where this is where I have their stuff. Got their little lantern thingies. Their street boots. I don't know what you call them. Anything down here? No? Okay. Alright. Um, supposedly up here. Though I could be off because I've been. Oh, here you go. Where did where'd you go? You go right there. Oh, here you That it's a uh, it's a wet place, and so of course, I mean, I guess I have space for it. Of course, the fire won't work. <laughs> Does this place just have multiple areas? Oh, yeah, multiple exits. Oh, that's ranking. Let's go this way. Oh, that's another exit. <laughs> okay. Cave. Okay, I'm definitely going to have to go down here pretty soon to get all that stuff down there, but I'm going to come here first. Zora makes sense, but no. It's just another exit? Yeah, okay. Interesting. Curious or curious? I wonder if that is another exit. 
I mean, it's close enough, it could be any of these, really, but... stuff in this cave. Oh, there's a treasure chest here too. Oh, long throw. Um, what do you mean? Trash stuff here. Okay. Oh, oh wait, that's right there. Um, is that everything? Here's the thing. Thing. Oh. There we go. All right, where were we? We're up here. Supposedly, there's another one up there. Oh. Master Sword on a choo choo. So what? Let me just start using this one. Okay. Um, let's try to get the pot. No cave entrance. I'm thinking there's not a cave entrance here. Oh, there's one easy. Is it 
gotta be one of the weirdest ones here. Oh. First. Okay. I mean, at least I got this for us. Was there actually an entrance here? No. <laughs> it's a nice little place to get away from the rain. And there's a well. Ah. Okay. That's one of these. Nice little construct horn. Arrows. And that's all my life I've lived for food, and food has lived for me. I always thought that anything was edible with prep and effort. Until now. Strange mechanical horn like thing someone gave me on the road was definitely inedible. Definitively inedible. If it were from a monster, I could cook or boil it, make it into a medicine, find some way to get it into my stomach. So, what creature is this from? I was told it fell from the sky during the upheaval. Well, what does that mean? Perhaps I tried to eat something beyond our understanding. Wonders truly never cease. Chef Aori Tamu, food's dance partner. Okay, cool. Yeah. Oh. Get out of here. Yeah. It's not raining anymore. Okay. Um. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna say this. Man, like forms a perfect thing though. But I'm gonna say it's not there. Or just this would be any way that it could be in there. So I'm really missing something. Yeah, anyways. Um Where's the next treasure? Or treasure <laughs> cave down here. Okay. We will follow this down then. Right past the bridge. There's a bridge. Huh. A ravine, but... Is there a cave here? No, it's just the ravine. Oh, there's one of those trees. Yeah, not worth it. Okay. The blue piece, see one. Come <laughs> arrow here. Hey, dude. Nars. You've got some skill. They hardly pose a challenge to you, let alone a threat. Your battle prowess deserves a show of appreciation. Please, I insist. Mighty mushroom skewer. Mm. Though I may not look at it, I'm a monster hunter of some small renown. I spend my days traveling the lands of Hyrule in pursuit of a myriad of prey. With the request of a fellow named Colton, I'm presently hunting bubble frogs, mysterious cave dwelling creatures. Mm. <laughs> I have heard that one such beast lurks in a cave in this very region. The question is which cave? All the caves. Okay. Um. There's the bubble frog. 
go ahead and get this first. All right, everyone, my recording gave out as I was shooting the bloopy, but suffice it to say, we found the cave. So we're going to go ahead and do this uh, next time, since this is the end of the episode. Thank you all for watching, and you guys have a great day.